Hey everyone, I'm coming on to show you how I did these three things here using the HTV Rond Auto Tumbler Heat Press. Okay, here is the heat press here. So let's get into the items that we will be sublimating today. So once again, our three blanks are a cup, a frosted Libby glass, and we have a 20 ounce tumbler. Now you know your girl does not have a sublimation printer. So I am going to be using the Cricut Infusible Ink, which is the next, next thing when you don't have the printer. So I'm in Cricut Design Space, and these are the three images that we're using today. And I'll have the link for these three images in my description box down below. And now we're sending our images to our Cricut to be cut. Okay, the first thing we're doing is our Tumblr, and this is our image here. It says Imani, my granddaughter's name. I'm making this Tumblr for her. So we're just gonna place it on here. And since I'm using the infusible ink, it comes with the backing on it already. Okay, so we're gonna press it for 385 for 120 seconds. So we're just placing it in there. Be careful because it's hot. And then we're gonna press the green. And you see it's closing. And we're just gonna have it press. Okay, now it's finished, so it's opening. And then we just have on our protective gloves and take out our tumbler and did i mention the tumbler is 20 ounces so we're just going to set it down to cool off just a bit because it's very hot okay so now it's cooled off a bit so we're going to remove our carrier sheet and then take off the pieces oh look at that that looks so nice there we go it says imani isn't that nice that it pressed it really nice I didn't have to do any work just press the buttons and the machine does its stuff so I'm just gonna put the lid on our tumbler doesn't that look super cute and it was so easy to make now for our next thing we're gonna be doing our Libby um, frosted cup here So we're just going to place it into our tumbler and this one now is 380 for 240 seconds and we press the button for it to start the manual that it comes with tells you the temperature for everything that you are pressing and it gives you the seconds and everything ah, it's done so it's opening and I turned it a bit and then I put it to press again okay now it's ready so we're going to take it out and it's extremely hot so we're just going to rest it to the side and wait for it to cool off a bit. Okay now it's cool so we are going to remove and see how it looks. That looks so nice. I love the tiger print. So again, we have the straw with our bamboo lid and we just place it on top and there we go. And the last thing we're going to do now is our mug. We're going to do our coffee mug. Cricut Design Space template for the coffee mug is so neat. It gives you the exact um, width, length and all that stuff and then you just wrap it around your cup. And then you're ready to go they do everything for you it's so neat all right you guys I have to set this one now for 385 and the temperature is a little higher sorry the seconds is a little higher 360 seconds at 385 so now we're gonna put it in all right you guys I didn't realize my camera died the battery died <laughs> 
and I was still going away. <laughs> Didn't know it wasn't recording. But anyways, um, I, it pressed and cooled off for a bit. So now I'm going to remove everything so we can see how it looks. Doesn't that look nice? OMG. A nice coffee mug. I love this auto heat press because I don't have to do any work. Just put the stuff in, set the temperature, set the time, press the button, it closes, and then it releases and open up and I just take out my products. All right, everyone, here's everything I did once again using the HTV Rond Auto Tumbler Heat Press. It's so neat. It does everything for you. You just press the button and it goes. And the manual, like I told you before, tells you the temperature and the um, pressing time for each of these items. And after 15 minutes of not being used, the machine automatically shuts down. Isn't that neat? So it's a great safety feature. I will leave the link below to the HTV Rond Auto Tumblr Heat Press so you can go over and check it out and maybe you'd like to get one for yourself. It's very easy to use. Like I showed you, no work involved. And I like that the keys are very similar to the 15 by 15 Auto Heat Press. <laughs> it's really neat. All right, everyone, that's all your girls got for you today. So I will see you again when I turn this camera back on. Bye!